hi guys welcome to my youtube channel if you are seeing me here for the first time this is flora's reality so in today's video it's all about me making beans and now this time around i'm gonna be using some some local spices or local ingredients so yeah let me introduce you guys to the ingredients that i'll be using in cooking these native beans with this recipe i was taught by my mom and guys when you cook it it will be so yummy right so yeah i have my fresh prepare i have garlics ginger onion ground crayfish i have my beans so this is it then i have my cow skin so it is frozen this is just coming from the freezer i have salt i have my ground white pepper now for the dry ingredients i have black pepper this is still white pepper that i haven't grind yet so i can use this or i'll use the ground white pepper so it all depends then yeah, I have my ground country onion. I have my seasoning cube. So yeah, I have Maggie Crevet and Maggie Star. I also have my dried fish. So we call this dried strong and fish. So this are all the ingredients I'll be using in cooking my local beans. Then when it comes to the oil, I will no longer be using vegetable oil in cooking this. I'm gonna be using red palm oil. It's not on my desk, but I'm gonna be showing you guys as I'll be forging ahead. So these are my ingredients that I'll be using in cooking these native beans. Yeah, so we're gonna be eating it with rice. So guys, it will be so yummy, so delicious. So there is no fresh tomatoes. I'm not using any fresh tomatoes here. So the first thing I will start by washing my beans because I need to wash this then I put it on my gas for it to cook so it might take close to an hour for it to cook so I have to start with this first so that while the beans is on the fire cooking I might be prepping the other ingredients so that I will blend So I already washed my beans. So this is it. It's inside my pot. So I'm gonna be adding water. Then I will turn on the gas for it to cook for almost an hour. So I will now go in with my water. So I'm using the, the hot water from my tap. So you can use cold, anyone, yeah. So now I'll allow it to cook. Then I'll be checking it from time to time. Maybe to add water. It all depends. So guys, my piece is on the stove cooking. I'm going to go ahead to soak my fish because it is hard. So I'll be soaking it in warm water. So I started prepping my ingredients so while the fish is in the water i will just allow it for it to sit and do the magic then i will now start prepping my ginger my garlic pepper onion and all my dry ingredients like i said no fresh tomatoes so guys in my blender i have my fresh pepper chopped onion ginger garlic then my dry ingredient my country onion my white pepper and my black pepper so i'm gonna put everything inside the blender and then i will now blend together so i'll go in with water then i will now blend So 
so as you can see it is now ready so i'm gonna set this aside so guys my beans is ready so in here i'm gonna be putting all my ingredients so let me be showing you guys how i do this so i'll go in with my cow skin some seasoning cube my dry fish chopped onion my crayfish then I have my blended ginger garlic country onion bush pepper onion and pepper then white pepper then i'll go in with my red palm oil then i have to put in some water i think that will be all then i'll allow it to cook for a while so i'll go in with some water then i have to mix everything together all the stuff so I like this to cook for a while before I'll show you guys so guys food is ready look at my beans using local country spices to cook my beans so it's so delicious mmm the aroma wow the scent of the country onion the black pepper the ginger the garlic white pepper i mean guys try this recipe okay delicious beans so i'm gonna be boiling my rice that will be using these beans to eat right please subscribe to my youtube channel like this video give this video a thumbs up click on the bell notification button so that anytime i post a new video you'll be the first to be notified right so let me boil my rice then i will dish the beans and then i'll show you guys so keep washing thank you so guys i have in my rice so i'm gonna be washing this to remove the stash so this is the rice we're gonna be eating it with our beans so i'm using the hot water to wash my rice so i'm washing to remove the stash from it So at this point, our rice will soon be ready. So this is our white rice. So I'm going to allow this to cook again for some few minutes. So guys, my white rice is ready. I'm going to put this in a pan. Then I will show you guys alongside with the beans, okay? To have turned off the stove so i'm gonna send this and put it in a pan guys my food is ready so this is my beans look at this oh my goodness and we're gonna be eating it with rice so please you are invited to come and eat with us thanks for watching my video thanks for cooking with me i love you all stay blessed and god loves you bye i'll see you all in the next one say bye <laughs>